Oké, okay, hey, hello everyone, welcome to the recording of Warframe. Ja, yeah, fucking hell. It's this uh, ass's birthday, like my ass. It's definitely not a special occasion at all, nobody really gives a shit. Yeah. I mean, it's going to be 24 hours uh, livestream on Twitch. Yeah. Good luck with that, by the way. Try not to die. Oh, don't worry. If you I'm... do die, if you do die, d don't bother me with it. Just, just die and get it over with. <laughs> just die and, and, and give me your uh, your graphics card. Yeah, that's it. I don't. I'm not interested <laughs> in the rest of your PC. Just the graphics card. <laughs> yep. Because oh my god, I just love this uh, 960. Well, and my Steam account. You'll probably want that as well. Uh, no, not really. No. Oh. Because even though your Steam account has a fuck ton of games, I know that I probably won't play any of them. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> so all those weird ass little games that you've got. <laughs> I still, I think, if I if I take a look at the email like after the recording, I will see that I have a couple of games still uh, that I can accept. Because I know I got mails from Keymailer and I don't have uh, looked through those mails yet. So that's always fun. Well, it's free stuff, so that's uh, never bad. Yeah. Okay, so so I still need plastic. Yeah. <laughs> that's actually the only thing that I need. Well, I'm currently in a survival mission on some planet somewhere with another bunch of other random people. Okay. I can wait. I, I can do the same thing as that I did yesterday during the stream. Just bullet jump through my whole ship. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's the only thing I did last time. Yeah, this video gets uploaded at literally midnight, literally the same time as that stream starts. Alright, so people have a choice to make. Are you going to watch the fucking stream or are you going to watch the video? You can't. Yeah, or watch the stream after the video. That's working as well. I'll quickly just do some small missions on Earth. Yeah. Probably a good idea. Yeah, trying to get some um, loot in. Now we finish this business. Yeah, just next to just next terminal mission, uh, one to uh, level one to three terminal mission. Why not? <laughs> because this is just going to pretty much one shot everything and not earn anything. <laughs> yeah, maybe just get a bit of my weapons, uh, at least a bit of experience. A little bit of loot. Like, I don't know what I miss and what I still need, so... There is a large platoon of Grenier Marines stationed here. Leave no one standing. How do you switch... Uh... How do you switch your pistol? F. Thank you. Why would you even switch to your pistol? Uh, there is a little mission that I have, like a side mission to kill 10 or 20 enemies with a pistol. Oh, uh, right. Ah, uh, fair enough. They spotted you. By the way, I've been a total fucktard and I've actually bought myself a pair of butterfly wings. Because why the fuck not? Okay. Sounds fun. They do look amazing on my warframe here, though, so... 
Oh, that's bad. They, that, 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 they've got this really cool feature that when you, when you're just walking around, they actually fall down, and when you start flying, they open up, which is really fucking cool. Oh, nice. Bless you, two times. Thank you, two times. By the way, dude, have you ever done the second dream quest? I don't think so. Go look in your quest and see if you've done it. The second dream and the, and the quest called The War Within. Because ever since I've been starting playing this game, people have asked me that question the entire time. Have you played this quest yet? And I haven't, so I'm really looking forward to it because it's apparently like a giant plot twist in the story that kind of classy has already spoiled for me anyway, but I still want to play it. Because apparently you unlock like another an entire new game when you get that quest done. Okay. Yeah. I got my affinity. Heads up, a Grenier assault team is headed your way. No, oh, Grenier assault team is headed my way. Haha, <laughs> good luck. Uh, they can eat dick. They dead. Oh, there you are. I'm almost through all of the, um... Enemies killed as well, like I need to still need to do five. The enemy is broken. Well done. Now get to extraction. Oh my bronco is actually almost leveled up. Nice. Oh, I got some rubedo. Woo. I actually randomly got 21 rubedo from um, a little thing in the ground. Yeah. Now, Earth is the rubedo planet. Or one of them, at least. So if well, you want good. some rubedo, you usually go to Earth or the other planet. I don't know which one that is, because I've only ever been to Earth. So my health is already full, but that doesn't matter. I can see your Roberto stash again. Nice. Give me those sweet Roberto's because I fucking need them. So there is this. Oh, the Bronco is actually level 24 right now. Nice. Yeah, level up one time. <coughs> so that is already a bit of progress to my level, to my uh, mastery rank. Yep. That was the 5,000 affinity that I got from uh, leveling. Um, that's what I'm up. From um, doing that mission with the pistol. <laughs> Which friendly is my Bronco. Yeah, I'm glad. I actually got 15 endo as well. Nice.
Oh, Lord, I can actually make the Rhino Chessy again. <laughs> yeah, because, like, I, I have the stuff for it, but, like, I already have the, the, the Chessy. Well, there's no real reason to make it again. No, I'm just going to... Just for fun. I oh, know. Do I need the neural sensors for something else? Uh, you're probably li you're likely going to need uh, for somewhere else anyway. Somewhere. Okay. Don't know what yet, but they're pretty uh, pretty good item to keep around. Just like neuros themselves. Yeah. And pretty much everything else. So our systems need blasted, which is literally the last thing that I need. Uh. Okay, I'm going to... A fun mission to do on Earth. Uh, a good thing to do is to just set your uh, uh, your matchmaking to public and then uh, try the assassination boss mission. Just farm the boss over and over again. See what kind of warframe comes out of it. You mean Oro? Uh, no, I don't think it's Oro. It might. You, you could probably just do it on any other planet, though. It doesn't have to be Earth. Just find a random boss mission and uh, just use some random people to kill it. Oh, I can on, on Venus, like I think the one from there. Angry. Mm, I may require yeah. After all. Yeah, that one I can do on my own. That one I actually did yesterday on my own as well. Now you still kind of want to do it with multiple people because you you you, any, you share the loot anyway, the act the, the more important loot. And because most of these people will also be like farming this boss, so they'll be doing the same mission over and over again, so they'll be doing it like ten times quicker than you can. <laughs> so it's just like a, it's a real real help. There's actually no real downside to playing with people in this in this game, surprisingly. I don't even know where the mission is that I we need to do then. I found it. Uh, is it also so that the weapon you use the most uh, is the weapon that gets the most experience? Uh, yes. That is the case, but it doesn't really matter a lot. Okay. Uh, another trick you could uh, potentially do is if you want to uh, level up a certain weapon, is don't take anything with you, but aside from that weapon. Okay. Because even if you've got a level 30 uh, melee weapon, st some XP still goes to it, and that XP will be added to your mastery rank. But it's more it's more efficient to just not take anything at all because then all the XP will be given to the weapon that you're actually using. The on, the only weapon that you actually took. Yeah, that and the warframe. That and the warframe, but that's unavoidable because you can't you cannot not take a warframe with you. <laughs> It'll be fun though if you could just play without a warframe. Yeah, you're just a, you're just a floating weapon. Yeah. Oh no, I need to get 10 headshots, okay. <laughs> you need to get 10 headshots, but I just got my melee weapon equipped. <laughs> <laughs> yep. I actually headshot it uh, accidentally once already. They spotted you. Nice. Yeah, it was uh, the, the like, kind of bird uh, enemy. And if you really want to farm yourself a lot of res resources, you can also just get a random uh, survival mission on Saturn and just use a public lobby as well, because lots of people farm, su uh, farm these survival missions because they just take so long and you've got an endless amount of enemy so you can farm all the resources you need. I mean, yeah, right I now think. I've been going for about 19, mi 19 minutes doing the survival mission. It's, it's taking a while. But I just know that after we escape, 
We're all fucking loaded with resources. I got my my affinity for Do not doing head shots. as just another corpus proxy. This will be unlike any enemy you have faced yet. Fucking jackal. We've got robots inbound. We've got robots inbound. Eat dick. I actually got affinity from uh, loot. Well, that's always pretty good. Yep. This is why I love opening loot. Also, just because I need loot. I I'm, I'm the type of loot hoe. Of course, security override. Breach complete. We're free to proceed. Boss. The assassination target is here. Wipe them out. The boss is pretty fucking easy with the pistol that I have, actually. Uh, the bosses are, are pretty fucking easy anyway. Yeah, like, I just have to shoot two times at his legs, which is exactly what is in my pistol. And then I can just shoot at him two times on his head, and then... Like, he has its damage, and then I can just do the leg again. Because my pistol is some kind of shotgun. Or... I think it's like it's the wrong kind of shotgun. Kind of, yeah. No, that's the, that's the one I've been using.
Killing enemies! Fuck you, camera! Okay, I did it. They won't be bothering us anymore. Woo. Let's get out of here. Again, 15 endo. Actually quite needed that. Or at least like the endo, I could really use that. Let's see, can I upgrade in the Bronco? Get all my get to the mods. Something that I've been upgrading. Oh, more damage with this pistol in general. Hell yeah. So instead of 20% more damage than I normally have with this upgrade, I now get 100 percent more damage. Yeah, that's pretty good. But I have one item too much in here. I think the underneath conversion in here. Conversion is just Plus fifty percent electricity, whatever. Do you remember the old war, Operator? Order seems to have misplaced those memories. So now do more damage with this pistol, which I highly appreciate, because, I mean, I didn't already do a lot of damage with that pistol. <laughs> I like this pistol. I can tell. Yeah. I'm going to die. Rip. Yeah. Always in this game. Well, as long as I get some loot out of this and actually get out of it after a couple of minutes. Yeah. A lone Tenno operative is raiding this ship for supplies. You are here to distract the enemy. Trigger the alarm. Life support has been cut off. They're trying to choke you out. 
Hold on. I'm sending auxiliary life support. I've delivered a life support capsule to the area. Activating it will buy you more time. Loot here, credits, loot here, this is... Not no spores, okay? Okay. I'm a bad hole. I mean, just fucking look at this shit. I've just, I've been playing about for about 30 minutes, I've got about... 55,000 credits, I've got a relic, I've got a couple of blueprints for weapon and for warframe, I've got 545 endo, I've got 2,066 plastids, and an old bunch of other useless stuff. So yeah, these things are pretty good. <laughs> I can see that. Another life support capsule is now available. Life support has arrived. Uh, let's see. Because there might be a way that I can give you to, I can give you some of my plastics because I've got a fuck ton of them now. Yeah, like I know that there is a way. Uh, I think we might be able to do it by using a trading uh, depot on one of the uh, relays. Because he gave me plastic, or uh, not plastic, he gave me something once. Yeah, no, he did that um, using the gift system, so he bought that for Platinum and then he sent it to us. Oh, wow. I'm pretty sure... Do I have any Platinum right now, actually? That might be an even easier way. Oh, yeah. oh I've, I actually got some. Nice. I've sent you about 600 plastics, mate. Thank you. It did cost me 60 platinum, which I do not find to be worth it at all, but whatever. Life 
Menu needed. Extraction is ready. Our operative is making progress. This will help our cause. Critical life support levels. Extraction is your best option. Okay, so I actually um, did this little mission a little bit on my own, and I actually got um, 83 plastic from it. Oh, good. So I literally escaped in like five minutes. Good shit. We have 15 endo, about 4,000 credits, 150 nanospores, 83 endo, uh, endo plastics, and two nav coordinates. Mm. The inbox has messages for the operator. Anything about orders in there? Yeah. Alright, so go get your plastics from the uh, inbox. Yeah. Go uh, craft the part. This is gonna take a while anyway. And then the actual bar frame itself is gonna take even longer. About three days, so good luck with that. Yeah. And then after that, I want you to grab the highest level gear that you've got, because we're going to do some serious shit. So you didn't send me 600? Hmm? I can see that I now have 777. Alright. The message said I only got two plastids. No, you got two boxes of plastids. Oh, each, so has three, each, each has 300. So I still need to open them now as well. Uh, now I think you just instantly got them, but I'm not sure how it works exactly. What yeah, I do know is that I paid for two boxes of 300 plastic, so... Okay, it's the Rhino systems, right? That I need. Let me quickly see. Operator, or just wonders. What yeah, systems. Are you about? Insufficient credits. Oh, right. Yeah. Uh, just go into your inventory and sell some shit that you don't need. Yeah. Like the... what is something that I don't need? Miscellaneous... I mean the Rhino Chassis Blueprint, I have two of. Get rid of that. That's not going to be enough. I got seven other not a wing blueprint. Don't need them because I already got them. Okay, I got I got credits. Okay, well, go do your thing.
We got Rana systems in our building, and I need 25,000 for after this one. Yeah, well, that's pretty easy to get anyway. Yeah, it's like 4,000 that I now need. Yeah. Alright, so go get into the arsenal and get all your highest level shit. I think I already have that. You should never have that. Because you're still working on your mastery, you fucking idiot. Well, I had... Like, I didn't have any space anymore. Well, it makes space. <laughs> oh no, this is... Uh, I literally got a... Some kind of stuff that is like one level higher than my normal dual sword. Well, that doesn't really help. And MK1 Breton is level 23, it's the highest I have. Uh, and unless you want me to, to get a Boltor from level 0. Well, no, that's useless. Bronco is the only pistol I have if I'm. Yeah, it's the only pistol. We're really going to need to find some weapons for you, don't we? I got I got a hammer level zero as well. Huh. Anyway, so grab grab the highest level of everything that you've got. I really had hoped that your rifle would have been level thirty thirty by now, but it's not. Yeah, I had a level thirty rifle, but since I literally wanted to have that hammer, I had to sell something. And because I started using the rifle I'm using right now. So you sold your only high level weapon? Yeah. Oh my god, you fucking noob. Oh god. Yeah, I literally got my highest level gear right now. All right. Let, wait, let me actually uh, quickly do some mods uh, into that staff thingy. Actions, how to install, please. Okay. It is how to install st shit. Some stuff. Alright. So you can pretty much not invite me. Let's go do some serious shit. The first thing that we're going to do is on Uranus is a mobile defense mission, which is always fun. Oh god. However, I will be taking my Frost Prime so I can use that snow globe thing to make it a little bit easier for us. Yeah, we need that. Let's die. Yep, let's go die. When this gear gets a full 30, I will keep it. I will keep them. Alright, good. Like I, ju I just need another Bronco so I can make the uh, combination of the two as well. Because that is there as well. Mm -hmm. Two Broncos makes another weapon and I actually got the blueprint for that. And I'll probably have a level 1 uh, weapon at that point for my um, pistol. Mm -hmm. I need to hack one console. Alright, so pick up that thing. By the way, look at my butterfly wings. Yay! Nice. Look if I fly a little bit. <laughs> <you open>? <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> that is amazing. It is, isn't it? Alright, let's just rush it to the console actually. Okay. Proceed and prepare. The more you start playing Warfare, the less you actually start giving a shit about kin killing people and looting everything. You've got plenty, plenty of enough loot anyway. Here is a terminal. Get me in and get ready to defend.
Right, so got the snow glow up. I'm in, Tenno. Snow glow! <laughs> Uh, please just do my pistol because that's literally. What are those blue things? Uh those are no uh, problem to anyone, just don't attack them because you won't do any damage. But they won't do any damage to you, they're just looking. Okay. They're going to be useful in some mission, but... You probably, don't have, you probably don't have the stuff with you to accomplish that mission. I don't know if you've got a... if you press Q, I don't know if you've got a codex scanner with you. Yeah. Uh, use that on one of those blue things. How do you use the code scanner exactly? Well, you click on it and then you click on the blue thing. I need to find it again. We'll just follow oh. you. The blue, blue thing. We'll find the blue thing eventually again. Yeah. Fuck no, I always get stuck on this shit. Terminal spotted. Upload me and prepare to defend. Right near this. Detecting a large security force heading your way. It's the Grenier. I'm in, Tenno. This will take a moment. You, I mean, your weapons aren't even colored the way that your, that your guy is. Oh. Your warframe. Why the fuck not? Because I haven't taken a look at everything yet. There's literally a button, if you click on appearance of your weapon, it's copy warframe colors. It's a one click thing. I, have, I haven't even looked into that. Into those uh, options. Why the fuck are you playing this game? Because I don't really care about how things look, I just want to play things. Ow. Keep moving. <laughs> We're moving. I just, went, I just went straight over top. Nice. Location reached. Drop me in and defend our position. It's in. I'm in, Tenno. This will take a moment.
Is this guy teleporting around everywhere? Yeah. Still working on it. Continue to defend. I got four. I got eighteen plastics from him. The odds were against us, Tenno. All right, let's get the fuck out. Okay. I bet you got 18 plastics from this whole mission. Hmm. I got that a good haul. There we go, another mission done. Yay! Yes. I got 188 plastics from this. Nice. I got 15 endo. Hmm. I might Bronco uh, leveled up. Nice. And the probably is also showing me my Odonata and my Imperator, which the are to fall the systems chaos. from Check the Arc Wing. Alright. I don't know why it's showing me them. I don't know, are they? Whatever. Oh they well. They didn't get any experience, so... Eh. My pistol is level 25, though. Oh, wait, no, I get it. It's because all the missions on this planet are submersible, and sometimes in each level, you, if, you, if you jump into the water, which there's a lot of, you will activate your arc wing to swim around then. Ah. That's why it shows you that on this mission. Okay, I understand now. Tenno, there's a time limited mission alert available. Check navigation. So I need two neurots for another Bronco. Which I need for the AK Bronco. Yeah. Which means I'm going to be without a pistol for uh, some moments as well when I have doubts. Oh, do I really need... Okay, so the Furious is a... Oh, rip. Okay. So I need to both make a Bronco and a Furious. Because the Furious is going to be my um, weapon for the time being when the Bronco is... Uh, a way for being transferred into an AK Bronco. Yeah. And the Furious is just a submachine gun, I think. Yeah, I need six neuros for that. In combination. That sounds fun. Yeah, because I don't even know how to get neuros. Well, those are random drops. So you don't... I don't have really found a planet that's good for dropping neuros, but... Yeah. Uh, Stand by while I analyze the intelligence profiles of the Grenier. Error, not a number. Right, but I do the think that we've achieved the, uh, that the half hour uh, thing that we've set out to accomplish. <laughs> yeah, we, we have done about 50 minutes. Yeah. I mean, so if, I... we, if we want to remain playing, we can, but we can also do that during the 24-hour live, live stream anyway. Yeah, true, true. Just to diversify things up a bit. 
Yeah, like the, the picture for the 24 hour stream is literally just something random. It, it's like a couple of games that I placed in there that I might play, but nothing is uh, certain for that. Yeah. Like for instance, Game Request is going to be on, just because I will most likely not know what to play at some point. Oh well. Yeah, so the recording is ending right here. Uh, switch over to the stream if you want. Because that is literally where everything is going to be even better, I hope. I hope, hope. That, I hope that the stream the, the streams are always better than the recordings. Because streams I personally just like more. I just have something with streams that I just I just have something with streams that I don't have with recordings anymore. But yeah, have a good one, and pretty much until next time. Yay.